Hey guys, just want to show you another Filson product I got. These are the wool bibbed overalls. 100% wool, 24 ounce Mackinac. Uh, this is the charcoal gray. I got them in a 34 and they're unhemmed so you can adjust the length to whatever height you are. They say to go with your regular pant size and I'm a 32, 32. But uh, I went with the 34s and they fit perfectly over my pants. So I honestly wouldn't go with the regular pant size. I would size up. Um, they fit really nice with just long johns underneath too. They don't seem too baggy with, with uh, that thin of a underlayer. Um, and they're not too tight with just like a pair of pants. And I've even put uh, my other wool pants underneath and they layer up quite nice. So far they seem super warm. They're amazing. They're really comfortable. Uh, and they look great. Um, you got a pocket here on the side with a button closure, snap button closure. Uh, we got another one here, snap button closure. Now I've noticed uh, on the inside, if it's going to go through only one layer, then they put a second layer to uh, add strength to wherever there's a, a button. Or else uh, it has to go through two layers like this and then it's fine. Like right here, there's two layers, so it's good. Here, there was only one layer that it was going to go through, so they added just a little piece to make it a two layer. Same thing on all the other pockets, it goes through two layers. So this is like a whip stitch edge here. They bring it down enough to make that second layer on the inside there. So you got the pockets here, it's got a nice finish on the outside edge, really nice finish on the inside edge, just a whip stitching and then it's sewn right on that edge. Not a whole lot of excess or nothing, very beautiful. Now you got this pocket right here, I didn't even realize it had that on the website, kind of handy pocket. You got this pocket, and then the two little ones here. You got your regular hand warmer pockets. And then you have the two on the side, cargo pockets. And then you got a brass YKK zipper. Really nice stitching through all of it. It's right on the edges, how it's supposed to be. Beautiful. Looks like it'll hold up really well. Uh, one thing I noticed though is the pockets, like uh, the other pair of pants I reviewed, they don't have the extra layer in the bottom to add support or strength or whatever, but uh, sure they'll hold up just fine. We'll see in time anyways, I can always update you guys. Uh, then we got uh, bridal leather right here, and then a cotton elastic uh, blend for the straps here and all brass hardware it's got two buttons on the side here to ease getting in and out you can see also on the inside here they put a second layer wherever it goes through make sure there's second layer there add strength Love this size. Now on the back, the one pouch is not a button one. It's just easy access. It still has the flap. The second one has a real button closure. That way you keep it secure, whatever you got in there. One thing I realized is this bridal leather being so thick right here, it is a little tough getting this on and off, but it's not that bad. I kind of just push it up a little bit. And then pull it through like that. So in time that'll work out and get a little bit more floppy and flimsy, so I understand why they want the thick piece there. Uh, it's going to last a long time, that's for sure. 
but for the first few times going on and off it's going to be a little tricky. There we go. Usually I'll just undo one of them and then flop the other one down to the side to get in and out. That way you don't have to undo both of them. Now the pant leg is unhemmed. So I got it rolled up twice. You can see I got it unfolded now. It's quite long. So you can be pretty tall and uh, barely have to hem these at all. You'd probably just fold the edge under and sew it and you're good. Um, me personally, being a bit shorter, I'll probably take quite a bit off. I'll get those hemmed and then I'll do a quick update video for you guys. Show you how it looks after. They fit over your boots really nice too. Um, and they seem kind of like a straight leg right down to the bottom no skinny no bell just the way I like it now if you put a vest over top it almost looks like you're just wearing the Mackinac pants and it adds that extra layer of warmth underneath with that wool coming right up uh, it's super comfortable fits nice So overall the construction is awesome and they're really comfortable. Um, just remember, get a size up from your regular size or they'll be a little snug. Thanks again for watching my video. I can't even talk. <laughs> <laughs>